Hey guys, this is Neil Prime, aka Top of King. Welcome to my latest Break the Skin. And this Break the Skin focuses on the transformations of the PS1 classic, Parasite Eve. I really loved Parasite Eve when I was younger. I loved the transformations. CGI, yeah, not the best. I had tons of action fear. And in this video, we'll be able to get some of them and rate them. So if you enjoy this, if you do, please like, comment, and subscribe. Now on to the main video. Enjoy! I'll start off by saying this is the reason I got into Parasite Eve. I absolutely love this transformation. It sets up the scene perfectly. But, uh, but it shows you how the whole game works, how things transform, and it works brilliantly. I know it's PS1 graphics, but the atmosphere and the transformation is just perfect. I love the detail, the body horror. It is just so gruesome and so cool. As a young teenager, I loved it. And it just looked really good and it still does it holds up in my opinion it starts off with the rat just looking really nervous and you can feel its pain you can feel its anger you can feel what's happening to it then you see what's happening inside i don't know how realistic this is but the colors look great then i just love the fact that it starts off with the teeth it's subtle but really cool how sharp how deadly they look. Then you get the skin peeling back, you get the blood in the eyes, you get the flesh being ripped. That looks great. Then you got the cell. It looks like it's a sort of multiplying, like a cell, like it's splitting. I love the textures. I love that fleshy feeling and the fur. I love the way that the uh, redness of the flesh. And I just love the way that it looks in general. It just looks amazing. I just love the last pose of it and you can it gets you ready to fight it it is just a basic enemy but it looks great this transformation it sets up everything I love the design I love the atmosphere it's such a good transformation so what am I going to give this of course I'm giving this 10 out of 10 do you agree or disagree let me know in the comments next up we have Shiva the first boss of the game I do love this it's got the great atmosphere, body horror again, and some great scenes, but this one feels a little bit more rushed. It's still amazing though, and I love it, even though it's a PS1 graphic. I love the detail, and I love the way that it's done. I think they did an amazing job, and it still looks great. Other than being rushed, only other bit that I think is a little bit bad is the smooth skin of the dog. It doesn't look great, but there are times where it looks furry and it looks cool. And the flesh looks great when it's transforming. I love this. It reminds me of something from The Thing, but nowhere near as good as that, of course. But this is still good. I just love the way that you got this red flesh bursting out. You, got, you see the spikes on the tongue. You see the tentacles bursting out of them. You see his face splitting like cells you see the claws growing from him you see that mouth ripping from him and you see that tongue spitting from him you don't see the eyes or you don't see those claws those um i don't know what you call them so like insect that like caused that claw from him but i love the expression on the dog i love that the scene on the back and i love the way that the cell splits and i love the detail the mouth on the middle I just really love this I love the texture I love sort of that raw fleshy look to it it looks incredible still it really does explain how a normal dog to become a serious like monster it's done so well but this one is not quite as good so I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 if you agree or disagree let me know in the comments the scene of Melissa transforming into the hideous, deformed, yet somehow hauntingly beautiful Eve is important to the game, but I don't think they did a good job. It still has atmosphere and there are some good shots, but there's a lot missing. It just doesn't look good in my opinion. What do you think? I don't like it. I do love the movement of the dress and I do love the colours of the design but you don't really see that here. I love 
how long the arms look. Eve's design is great, but they don't show how it becomes that or show that. So for for me, this is getting a. I don't know what to give it. Um, I'm gonna give it a five. It's not good at all. I like this one a lot. It's different. I love the way that they make the idea of a T-Rex and coming to life almost believable and the atmosphere, the shops, all perfect. And I love the way that the slime is slowly moving and the way it takes over the statue, the skeleton. It just looks very cool. I know it's an outdated it's PS1, but I love the fact that the first thing they do is make the tail sway because it really shows you that it's coming alive. And the pose of the head shows that it's in pain. How can a skeleton be in pain? But this is, then you see the skin and the flesh forming and just looking grotesque. Even the skeleton parts now look fleshy and cool. They have a texture to them that just looks great. I love the angles. I love the lighting and I love the colours. That orange just looks very cool. And yet the fact that it looks translucent does help. I know it doesn't look it's not the best animation, but it works really well. I really do like this. Yes, you don't see the final form of the T-Rex, but when you see it in the game, that's what it's building up to. And I like that, it does its job. And it does a good job of that. For that reason, I'm giving it a seven out of 10. If you really disagree, let me know in the comments. PS1 Parasite Eve transformations. If you have them, please like, comment, and subscribe. There are many more Ricky skins and many more videos. So, with that being said, see you in the next video, guys. Bye for now.